Welcome back to my channel. We're going to be playing some Stardew of the Valley 1.6. I'm going to do some mixed bundles. I'm thinking about playing on the river farm, which is the first farm that I actually ever played on before. I'm really excited about it. And I think the goal is to marry Haley. I feel like Stardew. Incredibly quiet for me. Oh, there she is. <laughs> what? I don't think I've ever clicked that before. <laughs> hey, Clever, would you like to see an alien? Thoughts? Weird. Anyways, new farm time. I think I'm gonna play on the river farm because I, I have a lot of fond memories of river farm. Um, we're not gonna skip intro. I've seen it a million times, but we're not gonna skip intro. The alien wanted their privacy. I'm so sad. It's my best friend. I can't believe you do that to me. Do, 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 do. River is one of my favorites, actually. Um, I'm gonna start with a black cat. Um, it's the one that I first- I still have the save file to- 112? Did he add more shirts that you can just put on your guy? Because I feel like- it was not 112. I always default to the same shirt. I think it's that one. I'm baffled. Bamboozled, even. You know what? We'll rock with that. Actually, I kind of hate it. Never mind. <laughs> what in the world? That's the one I always default to. I knew it was some kind of tealy color. You know what? Let's stay true to form. Black shirt, black pants. Live my truth. I can't change my shoe color, and that's so sad. There we go. What is name? Probably that. That's probably name. Oh shit, I don't know what to name my farm. I was gonna look up farm name generators. That's what I was going to. Meadowbrook is cute. Not so much meadow on the river farm, unfortunately. Forks. I, I'm gonna be so for real. Whenever I started my, um, I started the Meadowlands farm, just for funsies, I did name it the Meadow Farm as a reference, unfortunately. Misty River, we'll do that. It's giving me Dracula vibes. Name it Farm Farm. See, the funny thing is, my very first river farm was simply named Your Farm because I couldn't decide on a name and then I never fixed it. It's still named Your Farm, even though I went into the code and changed it from a river farm to like a standard farm because I wanted more crop space. My favorite thing. And we know, we know, Riverland, we're doing remix bundles. Um, let's not guarantee year one completable. Mine rewards? We'll remix those too. As a treat. Just here to have a good time. Let's go watch grandpa die now. And for my very special granddaughter. Continue, old man. <laughs> I want you to have the sealed envelope. I forgot that you can't skip, like, make him talk faster. No, no, don't open it yet. Have patience. Now listen close. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. I haven't watched the intro in so long, boy oh boy. <laughs> and your bright spirit will fade before a growing emptiness. You're so right, Gramps. When that happens, my dear, you'll be ready for this gift. I wish I could inherit a whole ass farm. Actually, I think I would hate it. Now let Grandpa rest. Rest in peace. Oh my god. Gramps, give me my gift. Woody from Toy Story? Sorry. <laughs> that 
That's just a dead guy. I've never noticed that before. That guy's just dead. What the fuck? <laughs> I think the last time I fully watched the intro was when I was playing my first ever farm. No, that guy was dead dead. You can't tell me he wasn't. Oh, I guess I should probably click that. Dear Kieran, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I'd lost sight of what mattered most in life. Real connections with other people in nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. I've enclosed the deed to that place. My pride and joy, Misty River Farm. It's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This was my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, my dear. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? Sure, Gramps. Life's better with Jojo? Jojo's was <laughs> Joja. There's an A in there. How dare you disrespect the name? <laughs> Lewis is... I think everybody in this... Everybody in this town has to be cursed with some kind of once upon a time bullshit because they don't age. Except for if you have children. Yeah, it would be a better game if Lewis was dead. That wasn't really... <laughs> um, I don't think- I think I've lost my talking privileges. Hi, Robin! Hello, you must be Karen. <laughs> I'm Robin, the local carpenter. Mayor Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. He's there right now, tidying things up for your arrival. The farm's right over here, if you'll follow me. Okay. <laughs> this is Misty River Farm. Ah! What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's still some good soil underneath that mess. With a little dedication, you'll have it cleaned up in no time. Um, I've actually played on the Meadow Farm in a multiplayer and in, like, personally. And I think it's fun. I haven't gotten to the point where I've, like, cleared it off and, like, made, like, a farm plan or anything. So, yeah. Th that's whenever I figure out if I like a farm or not. And that's why I completely changed my river farm once I started making it look like a cute little place. Ah, the new farmer. Hi, Lewis. <laughs> Welcome, I'm Lewis, mayor of Pelican Town. You know, everyone's been asking about you. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. I do like the chickens. I don't like that you don't start with any parsnips. That's just me. So you're moving into your grandfather's old cottage. It's a good house, very rustic. Oh, to be moving into a little cottage. Rustic, that's one way to put it. Robin! Crusty might be a little bit more apt though. Rude. <laughs> Don't listen to her, Kieran. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied so you can buy one of her house upgrades. Anyway, you must be tired from the long journey. You should get some rest. See, I'm very much so not a livestock girly. Like, I want to plant and, like, maximize my farm space. But I love playing. I love fishing in Stardew Valley. Tomorrow you ought to explore the town a little bit and introduce yourself. That's the plan, bestie. Townspeople would appreciate that. Well, maybe if they get out of their fucking houses. If I don't meet Elliot on the first day, I'm going to be pissed. Oh, I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in this box here. I'll come by during the night to collect it. I only ever use the box. Well, good luck. Thanks. I guess. <laughs> Let's go. Arsnip. Thanks, bestie. Is that... Is that what I think it is? You start with a fish smoker now? <laughs> what the fuck? 
you start with a free fish smoker? I don't want to clear this. Well, I guess I could stop cutting down grass and clear over here instead. That's probably good. That's insane. Does that mean all of the base farms have new things in them? I haven't started a new farm besides Meadowlands since 1.6 came out. That's insane! And I bet not many people have, like, figured out unless they've combed through code because everybody's playing on Meadowlands right now. Because I have not heard about that. <laughs> oh, a lot of Stardew Valley people on TikTok. Xander didn't have a special thing. Huh. I'm gonna have to cut some grass, I think, but it's okay. Is these days getting raised with handouts back in my day? You didn't start with a house and robin zone. Mushroom cave gets a free dehydrator. Yeah. Can't. Fine. Bottom left corner. Yeah, I have some mods. Um, so if you see up here, it like tells me my luck for the day. It says feeling a little lucky today. And then it's an XP thing from the UI info suites. Like Justin said. There's a couple of other things. Like I have a to-do list. Like meet townspeople. Plant parsnips. Buy stuff. I guess just buy seeds. Yeah. Buy seeds is gonna be top of my list. Just kidding, it should be plant parsnips. <laughs> I'm love mod, actually. I have a couple of mods in my game. There's automate, UI info suite, and then I think I've got another one. <laughs> Couldn't tell ya. And chop down another tree just so I can make a chest. Ta -da! You're still not enough to make a chest. Boo! Uh, get in my way. Yeah. I think you have to die. Parsnets? Oh, to do list. To do list, automate, and then UI info suites. That's the one I was forgetting, and I have a whole to-do list up there. Oh, I planted my parsnips. I'm gonna buy all parsnips. I'm gonna spend all my money on parsnips right now. Well, I guess I should buy one of each of these. I'll be back, Pierre. <laughs> I forgot to make my chest. Oh, also, UI Info Suites gives you, like, the billboard here and stuff, I believe, and, like, the calendar, so you don't have to forget. Because I often look at those things and immediately forget, but the UI Info Suite puts up a bunch of things up here. Like, it reminds you of the traveling cart, tells you, you your luck when it's, like, blackberry or salmonberry time on the bushes. I guess I could... Clay! Clay? And I still was like, I'm gonna go plant things. You're incorrect, actually. Thank you so much. Okay, back to Pierre's. Oh, I need to talk to people. When I see people, I should talk to them. <laughs> I'm trying to get the min maxiness out of my brain at the moment. And it's not working great, but... Hey, Harvey. I've been playing a lot in my save where I'm trying to romance Harvey. I don't remember if I said it. I'm, I want to romance Haley in this one. <laughs> yes, the recipe one is great. Hi, Sam. Sam, Sam, good to meet you. I forgot to read those. I was going to read all of the things, and then I just forgot to read some of them. Marnie. Uh, Mayor Lewis told me you just arrived. I'm Marnie. I sell livestock and animal care products at my ranch. You should swing by sometime. Thanks, bestie. Here we go. Oh, that's right. I heard someone new was moving on to that old farm. 
It's kind of a shame, really. I always enjoyed exploring those overgrown fields by myself. Well, you were trespassing. Hey, it's Miss Kieran, the new farmer. I'm Pierre, owner of the local general store. If you're looking for seeds, my shop is the place to go. I'll also buy produce from you for a good price. A little agriculture could really inject new life into the local economy. Sure. And now I'm going to spend all my money on parsnip. Thank you. Goodbye. Leah! Hi, it's nice to meet you. Oh, it also tells you if it's going to like rain. I'm trying to romance Elliot in your new game, but all this stuff you like. It is. Um, I'm, I've romanced Elliot. I'm working on romancing him for the third time, which is, um, uh, predictable. Uh, but yeah, I just spent all of my time fishing and trying to get to the point where I could get crab pots. So it helped that I was also on a river farm when I was doing that. <laughs> Play! But, Brute Cave, once you do get your cave, is also so helpful for Elliot. Until you can get a pomegranate tree. Lobster and pomegranate are my best friend. Z. I would rather be sluggish, is the thing about me. Then not water all my crops. And if I pass out, I pass out. It's a stupid thing for me to do. But I live my truth. See, because I don't even have stuff to make anything. Good night. <laughs> I said I'm relaxing today. <laughs> I would rather my seeds be watered, Justin. I'm not playing the min-max today. Willy! See, Willy. Slay. I don't usually play this way. <laughs> Bestie, it's fine. I usually play with a spreadsheet and so many journal and try to finish the community center in a year um and i just didn't want to do that this time i just want to be so casual about it and so i am I'm just gonna water my plants then run around and meet people today oh the map also where i can see everybody i also have that I guess I should probably fill up my watering can. So I don't have to worry about it tomorrow. To the beach. To the beach, each. See, it's gonna rain tomorrow. It's also bad luck. Maybe you should stay home today. What if I don't wanna? Thank you, Min Judge. Trash hat? Give me trash hat? No. Mm, trash hat? No. Daffodil for Haley. Thanks. Oh, I guess that should go to the community center, actually. <laughs> Willie! This is my best friend. He doesn't know that yet, though. Can you explain the thing for Elliot? What do you mean? Ahoy there, miss. Heard there was a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet ya. The fact that I like Elliot? That's my guess. I'm still trying to unwind from a month out on the salty seas. It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Hell yeah, you did, bestie. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Here, I want you to have my old fishing rod. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive. And hey, maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. I will. I 
like this guy. He's just not the one I would have guessed for you. Um, he gives me... I don't want to say vampire vibes, but he kind of does. Also, I was 14. No, that's not true. Yeah, it was. I started playing in... I think I started playing. I we were we had a conversation about this. I don't remember what year I started playing, but I just know. Oh shit! I stopped reading. <laughs> if it smells, it sells. That's what my old pappy used to say anyway. I love a writer. I suppose. Also, he has long, pretty hair. I'm a fan of gingers, and I would say he qualifies. Catfish. If it rain, oh, it's gonna rain tomorrow. If I'm feeling good tomorrow, oh, I gotta meet people. Let's go meet Caroline because I didn't do that. Oh, it's not even 9 a.m. Yeah, Shane, 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 hey, yes, like, I'll see oh. you around. Cool. Can I break into your house? Yeah, hey, Pam. Hey kid, the name's Pam. Don't be a jerk and we'll get along fine. Okay. Oh, hello, I'm Penny. Hi. Can't meet Gus until later. When it opens. And I don't think either of the sisters come out of their bedroom. Vincent! Oh, stranger, my name's Vincent. Mama says it's not- says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. You should still not talk to strangers, Vincent. <laughs> Don't know what else to tell you. Yeah, sisters aren't out of the house yet. Trash. Trash. Jazz! Hi. So true, bestie. Jody. I already met Sam. Oh, you aren't exactly how I imagined, but that's okay. I'm Jody. It's a quiet little town, so it's very exciting when someone new moves in. Having a farmer around could really change things. Okay. <laughs> um, I already met Marnie. I met Shane. Met Leah. I haven't met Clint or Gunther yet. Or Elliot. Elliot's still in this cabin. Um, yeah, I guess go meet Clint. I guess, if I have to. Hi. I don't think so much. Who else do I still have left to meet? Emily, Haley, oh, Evelyn, and George. I can just walk into their house. I have a dog knocking on my door. I love that for her. I told my brother to let her in whenever he was walking them, so that might be what's happening right now. You hear breathing in the background. That is, in fact, my dog. She is also drinking out of a water fountain right now. Gus? No. Forgot what I was doing. Oh, Evelyn and George. I'm manifesting you can't hear her. You're getting to meet all these new people, huh? It's their true bestie. Name's George, by the way. Now buzz off. Grumpy old man. Evelyn's not here anymore. Do, 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 do. Did I meet Caroline? No, is she in there? There's so many people in there. Oh, they're doing their, like, little jazzercise class. Shortcut. <laughs> I don't know if that's actually what it is, but I know she's hanging out of there. Oh, I can read it on your face. You're gonna love it here in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. Cool bestie. Hello, you must be here in the new farmer. I'm Caroline. My husband runs the general store here and have you met my daughter Abigail? She's the pale one with the purple hair. Well, my mom would probably describe me approximately. How old am I? I gotta stop making five years ago. Yeah. Five sounds right. Okay, now who's left? I know Evelyn. I gotta meet Haley. That's Maru's at work. You can tell by the little nurse's outfit she's wearing. Kieran, purple hair indeed. I've had red, orange, yellow. I've had the rainbow. Aren't you the one that just moved in? I'm Maro. I've been looking forward to meeting you. Hey. 
You know, with a small town like this, a new face can really alter the community dynamic. It's exciting. You know what I think is exciting? The fact that you just broke HIPAA. I should not have been allowed behind that counter. Gus! <laughs> Gotta have patient records back there. Well, hello there, I'm Gus, chef and owner of the Stardrop Saloon. Hi, please relax and enjoy yourself. Then you just repeat it. Okay, bestie. I don't actually know if she's in here. She's not. Where is she at? Hey, late. Oh, Evelyn has her doctor's appointment today. You can break into the patient rooms, I believe. Evelyn! You can call me Granny if you like. I love Evelyn. Now, where is Haley? Send help. Because why can I not find Haley? Elliot hasn't left his house. Send him to meet Demetrius. Oh, I see you. I sh should have known to check by the fountain. <laughs> Haley, I have a present for you. I guess I should wait, actually. You're the, far You're the new farmer girl or whatever. Huh? Oh, I'm Haley. If it weren't for those horrendous clothes, you might actually be pretty. Actually, never mind. I'm just wearing a black shirt, jeans. Leave me alone. <gasps> Wormies. <gasps> Seeds. I love winning. Demetrius. Greetings. I'm Demetrius, local scientist and father. Thanks for introducing yourself. I'm studying the local plants and animals for my own laboratory. Have you met my daughter, Maru? She's interested to meet you. I did, actually. <laughs> Your ass stick, though. Sebastian is 100% still in his room. Maybe whenever he goes out on a smoke break, I can grab him. I don't know if he does that every single day or what. Okay. Sebastian. Oh, I gotta meet Linus and Elliot. Fortunate. If it's raining tomorrow, that's usually how I mean. Yeah. But if it's raining tomorrow, don't mind me. I just like to live out here alone. That means that Elliot won't come out of his cabin like at all. Which is unfortunate. Takes forever to meet him. I have a snoring dog in my floor. She's having a great time. Do I just take the L and go back home and plant my carrots? You're still in your house. Elliot's not in his house. Elliot's not in his house. He gets his hair wet. I know. What would he do without his beautiful luscious hair? He has nightmares about you shaving it off. Elliot! Ah, oh, the new farmer we've all been expecting, and his arrival has sparked many a conversation. I'm Elliot. I live in the little cabin by the beach. It's a pleasure to meet you. Hi, Elliot. I have five of the clay I need for a silo. Because it bullies you to build a silo. Are you out of your house yet? No. What if I just stood outside of his door? I hate that they just stare at you while they fish. I love fish. Nice. Is it your first fish? Guaranteed that you catch it. Hello? He is smoking a cigarette by the lake. As he is wont to do. Oh, he's sunfish? Oh, my first one was a uh, smallmouth bass. Bass? It's not bass. Oh, he's all the way over here. I forgot, I was like... 
Yeah, I did. Out of all the places you could live, you chose Pelican Town. I inherited a farm here, sir. You don't... How fucking dare you? Is El is not Elliot. Haley is in her house. Yeah, he's just smoking by the lake. He also has a motorcycle. No, Sebastian is um a full adult. All of the bachelors and bachelorettes are at least 18. There's not like a definitive Ah, why are you doing that? Send help. I'm going home. I'm going to bed. I just want to go mining. <laughs> oh, I could smoke that fish. Get away! Freak. It's really rude of you. I was 40 gold where the parsnips you just destroyed. Oh, you're so right. I forgot about that. I only have a fish smoker in one of my saves. Which is my, you know, year six save that I've had since I started. Do you think I can find another daffodil instead of having to go back home? Harvey still wants that catfish. I could see. That's not what I was trying to click. Buying one seaweed. I mean, I guess, but mostly just because I want prize tickets. It's stuck on a bush. Trash. This is not a catfish. Yep. I often think about how many hours I spent fishing in this game just to get crab pots for Elliot. Think about that a lot. Especially spanning three saves. That's foul. Perfect. I can't believe you start with a fish smoker. River jelly. I'm excited to see what bundles we have in the community center. <laughs> I've never done the remix bundles. I like just getting mayo into it. That's so valid. Does he like mayo? Is mayo just one of those things that everybody likes but they hate to see you drink? I never gifted. I used to always just sell it because I was like, there's no point. <laughs> And now I'm like, I save it for a drink. Oh yeah, I need to go do that. That's what I was doing when I was coming over here. Listen, it's very good for energy. And I tend to run out of energy a lot faster in the mines than I run out of help. <laughs> Abysmal. Not a single piece in the entire collection. I think you should be able to marry Gunther. What's this? You found something? Let me see it. I did. It's a rusty cog. Do you want it? Remarkable. It's very old. I'd love to study this in greater detail. But it is yours. But it could be yours. Hmm. Got a favor to ask you. Would you consider donating any new artifacts or minerals that you find? What if I just said no? We make a groundbreaking discovery together. Oh, and who knows, if you keep donating, I might come across some interesting items to send your way. Think about it, will you? If you decide to donate, just bring the objects to the front desk. I guess if you really want them, I can give them to you instead of selling them for two gold. <laughs> Happy birthday! Money! More parsnips? No, I shouldn't do that yet. 
Did you find something? I did. It's old and gross. Reminds me of Lewis. You're so right. Huh. Tips on farming. Use fertilizer to improve quality, reduce workload, or hasten crop growth. I started saying it wrong. I just went with it. Fruit trees take a whole season to grow, but they require very little maintenance. Keep the area directly around your new sapling clear, or else it may not grow properly. Crops will die as soon as the season ends, unless they grow in multiple seasons. Example, corn. Some crops, such as kale and wheat, need to be harvested with the scythe. We're fishing today, besties. Shad, I've got new ideas to sleep on. Uh, the new Temple Rolling Talk? Yes, I listened to it the other day while I was avoiding doing schoolwork. Um, but I wasn't paying a lot of attention to it because I was stressed about the fact that I was avoiding schoolwork. <laughs> Which is a stupid thing, so I need to listen to it again, but I haven't really been in a music mood recently. But I do love Chapel Rowan a lot. I like Hot To Go, and I like- I <laughs> need to pay attention to my fish. But my favorite still currently is, uh, I almost said Super Massive Black Hole. That's not correct. Super Ultra- Super Mega Ultra? There's something great. I can't think of... <laughs> Is that not even the one that I like? I'm... My brain is working today. For sure. I'm clicking on the inside of the mouth instead of the top of it. I'm gonna catch this next fish. I'm not wasting all this energy for nothing. It's going to happen. Well, I caught it, but it wasn't a fish. Yes. And that's not even the one I was talking about. I don't think. I don't know. It's on Daryl's Bard's playlist uh, for D and D our strict saving game, which is very fun. Personally, I'm gonna have to look it up because it's gonna drive me crazy. Oh, fuck. What do I get rid of? You know what? No, fuck Clint. <laughs> kidding. No, yeah, fuck Clint. I'm gonna go plant these rice shoots. Thank you so much. Uh, Trixie. Oh, this red wine supernova. Red wine supernova is my favorite one. Crash. Because I sent it to Daryl and I said, this is so Trixie. This is so your satyr bard. And he said, hmm, you're right. I also sent him Party at a Rich Dude's House by Kesha. Because that one is so such his bard. Strix Haven. I love his bard so much. She's such a bitch. There's no point in keeping those, I don't think. I'm gonna sell all of, like, the good star ones. Keep you guys, though. Welcome to the family. Damn crows. Yeah. Yeah. See, that one was just a mistake of me existing. What? That was a mistake that I did when I was doing something that I don't remember. Was it getting the little wormy? I think it was when getting the little wormy. Nice, I'm gonna have some rice. Hmm. Fish, oh. Fish the rest of my energy away. Fish? No. 
for a disappointment. Happy level one fishing! Oh, but Justin, if you're gonna listen to her whole discography, please listen to Red One Supernova. Get away from my crops, you freak! Oh. Oh, they're carrots. I was like, what are those? What happened? Eesh. Eesh. Halibut. Is there anything else I need to do today? Daffodil. Hey, Lee, I'm coming for you. Anyways, I've decided I'm going to organize my clothes today. I'll have to throw out all of last year's styles to make room for the new ones. Okay. Daffodil? For me? Thank you. Yeah, bestie. I got 100 gold out of it, too. Two smallmouth bass? I can do that. Give me money, Willie. Slave! Oh, I need to go see Willie. Yeah. Give me my money. Give me my money. One of my mods is broken. Don't worry about it. <laughs> you saw that? No, you didn't. Actually, thank you so much. Oh, I'm in Willie's way. Okay, I'm going back home actually, and I can finish fishing at home if I really want to. Let's keep one of you guys. You know what? I'm gonna clear off this space so that I can get to the dock. Okay. I love winning! Treasure. Iron. Eesh. Sunny D is like orange juice, but if you made it synthetic. Worse orange juice, I would say. <laughs> yeah. I... It is... Less... You're right, it is less orange juice for a juice that is orange. See, I used to drink a lot of Sunday as a kid. Um, hey! Traveling merchant. Oh my god, he gets a cat. What do we name our cat, guys? Hello, Kieran. You see this cat here? I do. He's so cute. Found it sitting outside the entrance to your farm. I think it's a stray, poor little thing. It's orange, lime, apple, tangerine, kind of orange, grapefruit, and pear. That makes sense, in retrospect. It's such a weird flavor. Sunny D is. Yes, I'll adopt the cat. Just start naming all of my animals after indie characters. Listen, I think he deserves to live a happy and healthy life. Yeah, I know nothing about cats, bestie. 
Well, little Sparky, you be a good kitty now, okay? So cute. Yeah, all I know about it is that it's a bad movie and I've seen a couple of pictures of the cats from it. That's it. I know nothing else about it. Except I think they all die? That's the whole premise of it, right? Am I spoiling Cats 2019? This stream is not free from Cats 2019. <laughs> to our valued Joja Mark customers, our team members have removed the landslide caused by our drilling operation near the mountain lake. I'd like to remind you that our drilling operation is entirely legal pursuant in initiative L61091 Joja Co. Amendment. Responsible stewardship of the local environment is our top priority. We apologize for any inconvenience this accident may have caused. As always, we value your continued support, fuck you, and patronage. Morris, Georgia Customer Satisfaction Representative. Um, half. Take one. Die. Okay. Oh. Money! Build a coop. 4,000 gold. 300 wood and 100 stone. There are two theories. There's theories? Oh, it's like they're competing to die, right? Or they're all already dead and stuck in purgatory and are competing to be reborn. To Google. Oh! It's time we get to see all of our bundles. Oh, hi there. What an eyesore. I think it's neat. I'm a big fan of abandoned buildings. This is the Pelican Town Community Center, or what's left of it anyway. Listen, I'm going no spreadsheet. I'm going no spreadsheet, okay? These days the young folk would rather sit in front of the TV than engage with the community. But listen to me, I sound like an old fool. Yeah, I'm just here for vibes. That's what I'm here for. Jojo Corporation has been hounding me to sell them the land so they can turn it into a warehouse. No! Pelican Town could use the money, but there's something stopping me from selling it. I guess old timers like me could attach to the relics of the past. Oh well. I think this game would be so different if only Lewis was dead. And I think Marnie would be much happier and in a loving relationship with Marlin. Anyone buy else buys a Joja company membership? I'm just gonna and sell it. I can speak, probably. I can read. Here, let's go inside. Show me the bundles. I need to know. Dead Lewis mod win. I know that there's a mod that replaces Lewis with Krobus. So we have Mayor Krobus. Hmm, what's this? I guess Vincent and Jazz must have been playing in here. This place is even more dilapidated than I remember. Krobus would be such a good mayor. Krobus is a guy who can be a roommate if you're really nice to him. You saw something? I wouldn't be surprised if this place is full of rats. You're worrying me, Kieran. Look, I think I'm gonna head home and eat some lunch. You said, are you having, like, hallucinations? I'm gonna go eat lunch now, actually. I'll keep this place unlocked from now on. Maybe you can catch that rat if you have some extra time. Once you reach a certain number of guys in the museum, not guys, artifacts in the museum, you'll be able to meet him again. I believe that's how you do it. Show me. Show me. Oh yeah, forgot I gotta talk to the fucking wizard tomorrow. <laughs> I wanted to know so badly. Oh, you know who I can talk to? Traveling merchant. I'm going to the mines. Maybe I'll still go to the mines. Risk it. Despite the bad luck. Jazz, get out of my way. A normal farm-based errand. Yeah! You don't have to talk to your local wizard? Be nice to her. She's in my way! This is not where I'm meant to be. Also, it, I was extra mean to her because I wanted to check the trash can and she was in my way. I couldn't check the trash can. I've got places to be. Did I miss one of the new ones? Well, it's kind of hard for you to be helpful right now when I don't know what I need, ma'am. Why am I here? It's both because I don't see what, what I'm supposed to forage and also because I just leave them there. 
I'm tr- I'm doing better in this run in that I'm actually picking things up instead of just leaving them there. You can do it. Do a kick flip. Always. I ignored a whole horseradish. I just didn't see it. Hey, Liz. Fancy seeing you here. <laughs> Bitch. Yeah, that's what I thought. He was kicking and he was flipping. Um, and he was slaying as well, so consider that. I did just miss a leak. Okay, though. Hey, Marlin. I was just peering down into this old mine shaft. It's been abandoned for decades. Still, there's probably good ore down there. But a dark place undisturbed for so long, I'm afraid ore isn't the only thing you'll find. Here, take this. You might need it. Who said I was going down there? Not me. Did receive a rusty sword. I guess I'm not gonna go today though because I guess I can try and go for a little bit. Fun fact, these guys, those little weird ones like this, they'll give you mining XP. These guys, not in the least. Maybe I'm gonna take the mines casually. Usually I just speed run the mines. The mines are my favorite place to be. Yeah, I need that hardwood. Get rid of the slime. This is my life calling. I need that earth crystal. Get rid of the fiber. Nice. Okay, I'm going home. I meant to buy seeds today. Hmm. Fish! Haha! <laughs> I love winning! Give me another fish. I took no time at all. Fish smoker, I love you. Level one farming! I can make a scarecrow now. Farming, foraging, and mining? Cool. Hi, Clint. You want to get the most blah blah blah? Just so happens I had an extra set of blueprints lying around. Thanks, I guess. Smelt a few copper bars, considering having me upgrade one of your tools can make your work a lot easier. Okay, I'm heading home. I got some new items in stock. Cool. Yes! Around. So you've been exploring the old mine. You've got the adventure spirit. That much I can tell. If you can slay ten slimes. The adventure place in my adventurer's guild. Be careful. So true. Bestie. How many presents have I I've given Haley all the presents I can? This week, at least. But also, bad luck today. I don't give a fuck. buy some seeds scarecrow which I think I only need to get the wood for and then I'll set it up do, do, do. wood coal Scare crow. I need those things. Nice. Okay. And then it's the furnace, which I need 20 copper ore and 25 stone. Well, why would I name the Scarecrow Sparky when I named my cat Sparky and I keep forgetting to water my cat? Oh, 
Are you saying I should name all of the animals Sparky? Including the scarecrows, which are the opposite of animals. It's killing slimes. It's buying sea. It's killing slimes time. Get some tulips. Some kale. Some jazz. You like jazz? Um. Get nine cauliflower. We have five potato. Yeah, I'm good with that. Oh, I didn't even water the plants on this. Okay. I'm plant my cauliflower here. So they're extra safe. I don't know why I'm planting them like this, but I'm having a good time about it. The way I'm planting my crops right now with no rhyme or reason. I guess it's kind of got reason now. I got some rows of crops. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want them to all be in one like huddle, but then I only bought five of each. So I was like, well, I'll just put them in lines. And then I started putting them in lines down here. <laughs> I was like, why am I doing that? So, I don't know what that's about. Level five! Slime. Slime? <gasps> Boxes. Stone filled boxes. Well, there's a bug up here. I didn't even see you. Hi, bunk. Die, bunk. Die. See, I specifically remember Christmas episodes of Billy and Mandy. But that's because I used to wake up super early on Christmas and not be able to fall back asleep. And there's another one. But that's also, like, the only time I ever watched Powerpuff Girls, I think, was on, like, Christmas mornings. Whenever I would wake up before everybody else and then I'd go down to the living room, put on cartoons, and fall asleep on the couch. Bug. Yeah, we'll probably meet the wizard tomorrow, and then I'll call it a day. <gasps> it's a femur! The level 2 club. An old heavy bone caked in centuries of grime. Hot. Okay. It's rock and roll. What I wouldn't give to get good dating simulator games. I have a couple on the wheel that I haven't played yet. Or I haven't played a lot of. Um, oh my god, it's Sunday. We played a singular week. So proud of us. Stir fry. Let's do drugs with the wizard. Ah, come in. Hey. I'm Rasmodius, seeker of the arcane truths, mediary between physical and ethereal, master of the seven elementals, keeper of the sacred co You get the point. And you, Kieran, the one whose arrival I've long foreseen. He's much more attractive in his little sprite form than in this vibe, I think. Here, I'd like you to show- I'd like you- I'd like to show you something. Behold. It's a Junimo! It's my favorite little guys. You've seen one before, haven't you? I'll maybe consider expanded after I- Play a little bit more of it. Not expanded. They call themselves the Junimos. Mysterious spirits, these ones. For some reason, they refuse to speak with me. I'm not sure why they've moved into the community center, but you have no reason to fear them. They're just little guys. I bought my sister for Christmas a little Junimo planter. It's like maybe this big. 
and she hasn't put any like actual plants in it yet but it's so cute yeah it was um 3d printed the little junimo planter it was so cute uh, i should have taken a picture of it stay here i'm gonna see for myself shortly i'll return Time. Did I read that? I couldn't have read that right. Yeah, I found the note. The language is obscure, but I was able to decipher it. We the Dunamo are happy to aid you. In return, we ask for gifts of the valley. You are one with the forest, and you will see the true nature of the scroll. I have a cat chirping at me. Hmm, one with the forest. What do they mean? Mushroom dance, mushroom dance, whatever could it mean? Aha! It means you've lived a life of sin. And my cauldron is bubbling with ingredients from the forest. Baby fern, moss grub, caramel top toadstool, can you smell it? No? Here, drink up, let the essence of the forest permeate your body. We're gonna watch the trees dance. It's kind of bad for eye strain, so if you don't want to look at it, maybe close your tab, just as a note. It does freak my eyes out, because the little pixel guys are so close. Also, it's concerning to me how short the roots of those trees are. My cat is running around the room chirping. He commit crime. He didn't come over here though. So those trees don't stand a chance. You gain the power of forest magic. Now you can decipher the true meaning of the Juno scrolls. Please, please. Yes! Spring foraging. Okay. Winter. Wild medicine bundle. Oh, that's gonna be a lot harder. Black algae hops. Oh boy. Forest bundle, moss, acorn, and maple seeds. Summer foraging, fall foraging. Okay, so the new ones that we have in the main one are wild medicine and forest, which is going to be fun. Wild medicine might be significantly harder. Gonna be so for real. But forest bundle. Now that's something I could get behind. Um, I'm gonna start getting stuff to build a coop. Which means I'm actually gonna go back to the mines. <laughs> They Haley, oh my god, hi, I forgot to grab a daffodil for you. Maybe we'll find some on our leisurely walk. <laughs> They're so weird, sometimes I wonder if we're actually related. Okay. Oh, he's on camera. Feasting. I don't know if you can hear the gross noises he's making, but they're sure something. He's on camera. That's a guy back there. Haley? Oh, you're just- Oh, you haven't gotten here yet. Okay. Yes, for you. Have we hit one heart yet? Yes. Okay. Mines. I didn't bring. I'm leaving. I'm a fool. I'm gonna go fish, because I'm a fool. <laughs> we'll end off with a nice leisurely fishing time. I forgot to bring my, um, sword. And I don't think I want to try to survive there with a sword. Without a sword. Oh, fisherman. No, I lied. I'm not fishing. Maybe I just forage. Foraging is a good way to pass time. I could just run out my energy chopping stuff down here. Always need more wood. And stone. Just clear off my farm as a treat. Put you one step over <laughs> and block my mailbox. Give me that and give me five or complete the damn thing. Uh, yeah, my cat's names are The Void um, and Michael Myers. I named The Void. First name The, last name Void. Or I guess, hey cat. First name the, middle name void, last name redacted. Oh. 
were you, or were you not, just laying over there? Oh, Dan the Meme Man? My brother's cat's name is Dan the Meme Man. I love that man a lot. Oh, I need one more piece of wood. I can get one piece of wood. Yeah, it's over here. Okay. You're gonna go over here. With that, we say goodbye to Stardew Valley. I'll leave it up.